Greetings entities and guardians, my name is Hyper Himes, and welcome back to Kicker Run Kingdom, where the motorbikes just outside from Kibu Barakubi are just like going all the way crazy. I don't know why that's so loud. Apparently, recently, Kicker Run- oh, I think that's a bus. Apparently, Kicker Run Kingdom got a new update where it heavily evolved the guild system. But wait, what is that new thing? By the way, it's literally like one minute until the whole server resets and gives us new loot, so... Let me quickly go over to the guild battle real quick. Probably not going to get enough time to get my daily guild battles in, which is stupid. But you know what? That's my bad. And apparently we have to deal with a new cutscene. I'm sorry if there's like a bit of light over there. I have no idea where that's coming from. I think it's coming from part of the window. Which, yeah, that makes sense. It's one little split that I can't get rid of. So just ignore that. It's just fine. Uh, though before we start, I will try and read off comments from the how many new Disney cookies can I get video. Uh, and also, if you want to leave comments down in the comment section below, feel free to do so. If it's either a random question, a random comment, something random, a uh, random fact, something about me or something about the game, then feel free to do it or just post whatever you want because, hey, I really love responding to all your comments and you built this channel because I'm just kind of like the spokesperson and y'all are the real MVPs of all of this, so thank you so much. But before we even read this... Let me just read two comments real quick first. Michael Chang loves a comment saying, loves, saying at 7.30, it's actually the complete opposite. Blanc is French for white. Think of blank like a blank page. Okay, that's pretty interesting. Thank you for that information. And Valentine Chaco actually says, I can't do the task because I'm either have the decors and don't have the cookie, or have the cookie but don't have the decor. Oh, that's painful to hear. But anyway, no voice acting, so I gotta do my own. Look, there's uh, more rifts in the sky, and they're bigger too. And the clouds. They look different. Something feels very off. I, I, I think we might encounter a new foe. Hang in there, everyone. Prepare for battle. Destiny's Lament, Season 1. Started August 7th, August 16th. Great. Destiny's Lament, a new season started. Your scores were set when a new season starts. Alright. Oh, look at that. 200, 500, or 5,000 coins, 200 the gold things, and 20 of these, uh... What are these? Heroic Medals. These medals are awarded to the Earthbred's most stalwart defenders. Uh, use them to exchange rewards. I have over 200 of them. Oh, look, even more monsters have emerged from the rift, and they look formidable. Uh, to fight these new foes, we're going to need guild battle tickets. You'll be able to claim three tickets daily. I have 231. Well, I'm pretty sure I do. I think. You can fight each of these bosses up to eight times per round. I think it'd be nice to plan how you use your tickets ahead. Oh, this must be the guild tier flag. The tiers decided by uh, the sum of all trophies earned uh, by your guild mates. Alright, I think it's time to gather up all of our strength and send those monsters back to where they came from. Alright, by the way, I'm just saying right now, if any of y'all want to join the guild, it says it right there, Hype these Kingdom. There's a lot of open spaces for people to join, so I wouldn't mind if you joined in and just, you know, help with the guild, you know, help with the channel, all that stuff, we're all open. By the way, no one left a comment saying, All the more when they share the bliss, furthermore for the scape, uh, sake, uh, open my mouth and scream aloud with me, arise and break out, donate my place with humanity. That scares me. And you've been leaving comments recently like that, which, eh, whatever, do you do you. Uh, but anyway... I guess we should kind of get familiar. Let's go, since we have, I think, eight opportunities. Well, I, g I guess we can only fight eight times. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to fight the Red Dragon first. Because, the Red Velvet Dragon. Because this is kind of like how I usually would fight. And I'm pretty sure it's at level two. So we should probably easily just body this thing with our current team. Or at least a majority. So, uh, yeah. So I can only do eight out of eight battles. I do have a lot of tickets I can spend. However, I can only use eight because they got to limit me like that. Limit me. So, mm. Got some good water going. So here's my strategy. The moment that it shows up, the moment that ball shows up, four. Just use four of them once. After the first hit, use parfait. And then the real fight begins. That's when you use all of your cookies attacks at once. Now this strategy probably isn't optimal, but I will say it's the strategy that I use and it works out pretty well. To, to an extent at least. Don't use a clear too much though, because for some reason after every time uh, he uses his skill, it's just like he hurts himself for some reason. It's either some counter attack from the dragon, but I don't know. But anyway, gotta get this big damage off. Now I'm getting hit badly. Come on, stack up the damage, rake up the damage, rack it up. Let's do it. Heal Eclair, please. You're getting a bit damaged. It seems that the dragon has a lot more HP. I feel like that might be kind of scary. I will say, at the end of this video, I need to at least defeat the dragon. Why did the camera go blurry at the most important part, you know? I didn't need you to do that. I- Do you actually- I really hope you didn't blur at the start of the battle. If you did, 
I will be upset. I'm getting heated. I gotta take a sip of water again. Should've grabbed ice. To make it more cold. Okay. I feel like I should do... What's more terrifying? The Avatar of Destiny or The Living Abyss? Uh... I think I'll do the Living Abyss first, but before I do that, let's read two comments. Uh, ex or maybe a couple. The X Hunter says, I would like to get Bell Cookie because I already have Beast Cookie, and you really had luck with uh, your draws there, pal. Keep up the good work, buddy. Thank you so much. And also, Sugar Crystal says, personally, I think it's crazy how Cookie Run collab with Disney. I mean, like, Disney. That is true, it's pretty crazy. And Cookie Run Kingdom and uh, KRK, well, CRK and CROB Enthusiast says, There's only one animation for both Unlucky and Lucky draws. So there's only one animation, or there's an animation for separate lucky and unlucky draws for Disney cookies, because I don't know. I don't know how I can tell. Well, how about we do Living Abyss? Let's see how this works. That looks nightmarish. I really hate that. But right now I'm just running in with my strongest team. This probably isn't the best team that- Oh, it's eight separately! Because there's eight? There's eight. I, th I think eight. Oh my lord. And then if we go back, it's seven out of eight? Let me check. Yeah, it's seven out of eight. Still doesn't look like we made much of a dent in comparison to, like, normal level 2, but, like, out of, I'll give this one a gander. Wait, another member of the guild is battling Living Abyss of level 2. Do you want to play anyway? Well, does it make a difference? Like, does it really make a difference if I, uh, fight them? Another member of the guild is battling level, uh, Living Abyss level... But, like, does, can't I help? Do you not want me to face? Do you just want me to practice? Oh, here's our loyal chat right there. This is nothing. Anyway, uh... I mean, if it doesn't want me to face it, I don't know why. If you want to... Uh, I, I guess, I mean, it is telling me it's hard, but aren't all these hard? Yeah, hard? Is anyone else also fighting this? Or can I do, uh, the plebbing Alter Pleb? What the pleb is their name? I'm forgetting. Oh, uh, Avatar of Destiny. Can I fight Avatar of Destiny? I can fight Avatar of Destiny. Alright, while this is loading, love this update, but Dev Sisters are bullying me and giving me all the other Disney cookies other than Cinderella, aka my dream Disney cookie. Yeah, I really hope that you get lucky there soon. Oh, the light. Uh. Alright, I guess we'll just use all of everything that we have so far. Oh my gosh! What, what was that? Parfait, parfait, please, parfait, parfait, parfait. Para parfait, please. Cotton, get the heels up. We're being blocked by one of those gravestones? Excuse me, what was that? Oh no, no, go, go, go. We somehow did damage there? Are you, what was that? Before we go on, let's read a comment from Weird Pierre who says, I want Alice Cookie Gurr since one of the names I go by is Alice. And also, Chimmings left a comment saying, The update is pretty fantastic, but the only thing I would change, maybe some Disney cookies make him playable. That's understandable, which, you know what, that reminds me. Common question of the day if you want to decide to answer it if you got this far into the video. Who's currently your favorite boss in the guild battle update? Because personally, I, I guess I still like the Red Dragon because I'm just familiar with it. But, yeesh, this one's... What am I exp Okay. What if I try this again, but instead I try, uh, Parfait Cookie's ability first? Because at the at very- at the very least at the end of this video, I need to at least beat the Red Dragon. Like, that's a must. So, I guess I'll just, uh, literally activate every single thing that I have in my arsenal. Get the boofs- get the boofs, the buffs. Literally everything that I can, okay? Everything? Okay, that's getting stacked on. Dark Cacao is already dead, by the way. You've got to be joking me. Can we at least get rid of what? You've got to be joking me. This is an absolute meme. Literally, I can't do a single thing. There's nothing like- Oh, it was just a sheep left. There is nothing I could have done without that. I feel like I did even less damage somehow. I can't believe- I don't even know how to even describe that. Like, are you kidding me? Someone's alarm is going off or something, or someone's calling, but like, oh my lord, I don't even know how to, like, let me describe that. Oh, let's, you know, how many more comments are on this video, because I need to read some comments to calm myself down. Uh, Zen, who's at, who has some syllables next to her name, says, Cheese Cult. Stop. <laughs> uh, so, a uh, person with a name that I can't, uh, say because it's in a different language, he says, There is no difference between good and bad. Dang it, there's no difference. That sucks. Sunny Rise the Dragon says, The update is awesome. And Red for Herodom says, This is incredible. If I would change something that would be playable cook Disney cookie, but this is still incredible. I would like it if they at least made the uh, Mickey Mouse cookie playable. Oh, okay, now I can fight him. 
I guess someone was just on uh, at the same time as I was, and I was just doing someone else's job, I guess. Mm. Mm. Probably shouldn't drink water when it's that, it's that intoxicating. And by intoxicating, I mean just look at that thing, it's probably splashing us. Okay, activate this. This seems a little bit easier than the plubbing middle pleb, who did just incredible amounts of damage to us. Is, is Dark Cow getting eaten? What's going on? I can't use Dark Cow. They're literally being eaten. Like, they're just getting chomped up. Okay. Do I gotta tap on it? I don't think that works. What? They just took so much damage! What happened to them? How come? Well, I guess they are Charger, so they're taking all the front damage, but Dark Cow has gotten folded so easily. I think maybe there's a chance that I at least outlive everything, but like, I can't do any damage to, uh... Oh, I think there's a chance that I actually can defeat him, though. If I just do enough damage in the next run, I think it should be possible. Maybe I can defeat this boss and the Red Dragon? How much damage? How much damage? Oh, you, you know what? That's oh, two and a half million? That is so good. I'll take that. Game Wisdom Gaming left two comments saying, I think the Disney update is amazing, but I wish I wasn't so grindy. And also, you could try combining the Cookie Run Kingdom Story videos into a movie type thing. You know, I was thinking about doing that, but I feel like I want to just do a lot of the main game first before I do a bunch of compilation videos where it just combines all the story. But anyway, Shiny Luxio 312 also left a comment saying, My friend got pure vanilla this morning. I'm proud of them. Happy about them, but I'm pretty sure you left an emoji saying that it was kind of disappointing that maybe you didn't get lucky, but I hope you get lucky. And by the way, yes, but no, but also yes, just comments yes. Okay. Well, I guess while I'm here, I may as well just defeat you just so I could show it off camera. Because I'm pretty sure it should be possible. By the way, there's only like three more comments left. Uh, sea Fairy Co uh, Cookie left a comment saying, Yay, Hyperheim's made another video. And I'm going to keep making videos, baby, because that's what we do. Alright, let's hit him. Or hit whatever this pleb ap ap applies as. Uh, with everything that we got. I think if we don't even like kill in this round, we should be able to kill in the next. So I'm just going to go ahead and try my hardest. And yeah, I guess while I'm here, may as well read the rest of the comments. Coco Cookie left a comment saying, Hi Hyper, fun fact about Snow White, the movie saved Disney from bankruptcy in case you forgot or didn't know. Keep up the amazing work. Yeah, I think I heard about that, how Snow White was very, like, what was it, revolutionary? Because, like, it was, wasn't it, like, one of Disney's first animated films? I could be wrong on that, but I'm pretty sure it was one of the first, and it was a major success. But still, I think that movie is very good, and I really need to rewatch it again. And I, with that being said, I need to rewatch a lot of Disney movies again. Look, we did it! And we didn't even need to defeat the rest of the enemies, too. Look! Oh, we did so much more damage somehow, too. Sheesh! Uh, battle time left, 7 seconds. Go to the next level if you have 5 seconds or more battle time. No way, I could just... That's so cool! So if you... So it's like not a waste. So if, like, you fight the boss that only has, like, 2 HP left, but you have to spend, like, uh, one of your guild attempts at it, then, uh, it lets you go on if you have longer than 5 seconds. Which, luckily, I just have enough time to use all of my skills. And, oh, but I think, did it carry over the same, like, HP that I had, too? That's really interesting. I do appreciate that, because at the very least, I got a 373,000 damage off. It's definitely not much. But you know, I like that. And by the way, the last comment came from Adel, or Aid VR, who says, You know, if you sign in on phone, you can screen record the gameplay. You know what? I try that. But fun fact, I keep saying this. Anytime I try and screen record with this phone, the screen recording crashes because Cook Run Kingdom just does not like to have other apps open at the time of it being open. And it crashes, and it corrupts the recording, so I can't record anything like that. I'm sorry, but this is the only way we're getting Kingdom videos. Unless if I can somehow make... Oh, what was it? Blue stacks work on computer? Mm. I'm taking a big sip of water here because I just love it. But anyway, we just read all those comments, and I guess I'll get a head start on like some of the other comments from uh, it was the Disney Cookie Missions and my most powerful cookie yet. Because if you haven't seen that video yet, it's pretty cool. And there's only like 10 comments on it, so you know what? I'm probably gonna spend the rest of these. Just trying to spend uh, spend a little bit of rest of the time trying to take them dragon. Uh, no one leaves a comment saying, uh, The image of a face is on a wall with solid iron claws. A happy face to me, not a nightmare, just some nonsense. I don't know why. That sounded more cheery, but you know what? I like it. So I'm guessing the uh, this plebbing dragon is like kind of like the easy mode. The plebbing unforgivable like monstrosity of shadows from the Black Lagoon or whatever is like medium. 
and hard mode is whatever that holy prayer thing was. Like, it was an absolute nightmare. It just, like, destroyed everything. It, like, blocked you with gravestones I couldn't even break. And then, at, and that wasn't even, like, the bad part. The worst part was, like, when they just put a beam behind you and it slowly walked towards you. And you were just like, dun 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 dun. Like, just play the draws thing, it was like, duh, duh, and it slowly, but surely, walked towards you. It was just terrifying. Like, there ain't no way I was able to do that. Even get, like, a sizable amount of damage off. I couldn't even get a million. My lord. I don't even know what else to say about that. Cr a crownable pot left a comment saying, I love your voice acting, lol. Even the bird chirping, lol. Hey, I try my hardest when it comes to this. How much HP? That was 2.6 million. Also, uh... Oh, the cops are coming. Uh-oh. Uh, Valentine Chaco left a comment saying, Currently sobbing because I waste all my stuff on Oyster. Her skill is such a mess unless you have the most insane luck with toppings. I do not recommend any anyone to upgrade her. Wow. I'm so sorry. I really hope that you somehow make those rewards again. Uh, honestly, if I probably faced them off, like, two or three more times, I could get them down. But I think I should just end the video here because I think I showed off enough of this update. Uh, I'll probably read the rest of these comments in the next video. But for now, if you did enjoy this video, then please be sure to leave a like on it. And also share with, share with your friends for more Cooker Run content. And if you enjoy my content in general, why not subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you haven't yet, or you want to, hit the bell to be notified of whatever I do in the future. I also have merchandise available if you want to check it out. But I'm not forcing you to buy anything. I'm just saying there might be something interesting in the shop that you might be interested in. And also, there's a Discord down in the description if you want to join it. Because it's a fun time over there. And we're hopefully going to try and expand every day. But above all else, I will see you entities and guardians in the next video. Hail the hype knees. What is with these motorbikes and cops outside? Like, what's going on?